Hey guys and girls, welcome to Bus Town part 66. I just want you guys to have a look at this. It's like, you know, to be honest, uh, this city so far in city skylines has been my biggest achievement so far. You know, everything that I need to work out in this city and that went wrong in other cities does work out in this city no traffic jam a good working you know uh, industry happy people no empty warehouses working unique factories a lot of export big cash money mula in the bank what do you want more yeah a parking lot at the uh, you know basketball arena at the uh, liberal arts uh, Mm, trade school uh, campus yes that's the very place where we stayed over here it's over here and although it has a lot of parking lots by itself I'm going to add parking space right next to it really yes I do um, now I can just make a parking lot that goes right up from here um, but I'm not going to no no I'm not. But why not? Oh, just not. No, I'm not going to. No, don't argue with me. I'm not going to do it. I just take this road to the to uh, down, and then a little bit to the left, and then from out here I say we are going to create this parking lot. Oop, wrong button. And is that too big? Or not? Let's see. That's fine. And then to there. And a little bit further. And then from here we can create... Let's see, what is the distance? Six units. Oh, that makes me so happy! I think. <laughs> uh, corner. That makes me tree by tree. Covered by a lot of trees. Tree by tree. And from here to there works also as a charm and from here to there look at that now what does this mean it means like that whoever comes here parks the cars here and does not bother the entrance over here to this uh, place yeah so let's put some uh, some stuff in here to make these peeps happy no, this is not such a big place, so I think I don't need to time-lapse this stuff. Besides, you want to see me how I do this. Very, you know, this is a very delicate thing because it needs to be very straight. Like that. Yeah, thank you. And also here, we want to make this very straight-ish. Like that. And let's see for the... Yeah, we can put also one over here on this side. Yep, thank you. And we do the same over here, thank you. Now, uh, we're going to address the people's place for handicap parking. And we put that over here. Over here. Maybe I should have put this in a time lapse because actually this is such a boring task you know, to do. But yeah, it's a good thing that you just see it, you know, how miserable this kind of job can be. It's like really miserable, miserable, miserable to the bone. And as you can see, it will not fit in anymore, but that's okay. Because uh, you, know, you can just select a single one, you know, just a single one and you take it, put it straight next to it. Here we go, and here we go. Yeah, now you might think I would repeat this entire process for here and here. Yeah, guess again, I'm going to take the move it mod. I say selection, uh, trees, but I don't select the roads because the parking lot is technically a road. So now I am capable of selecting all these, these things. I don't know what it selects here because 
I don't know what that is, so let's do it from here. Now it's selecting something from here. I think it's a tree or something, an invisible tree. No, now it's okay. Wait a second, we have getting something. We have getting those two. I think it's a tree. Anyway, it uh, doesn't matter. Let's copy it. Copy. Yeah, you see it's a tree. So we copy this and we put that in between here and yeah, that's it. That's it. Now we take also the EV, EV parking, which is this one. We turn around and we do the whole smudge over again. Okay, I'm not going to bother you too much with this. I mean, this is like, you know, I'm, you know, I'm already annoyed by this. Uh, time lapse. Right, so, you know, if you have a few little uh, holes like here and there, don't feel spooked about them because it's not that bad. Uh, besides, you can also always use the move it mode to select them. I think. No. Wait, what did I do? What did I do? No, the road. So. Come on, I can select you. And I can move you. Yeah, I can move you. Like that. Thank you. Mm, where, was, where was I? This single, no, the single one, this one, the single one, this one, thank you, turn it around. And put also one over in here. And I think that will be nice enough for this place. Now, let's make some crossings so they can go to the other side. Uh, you know, with, let's use the zoo, nature reserve. Uh, Crossing, yeah, because that's a very that's a very nice crossing. Five units. Let's turn it up. Six U. And from here, and then down, and connect it here to there. And from this side, we do the same. At least if it allows us to do. Yeah, five U. Six there, and then there. And then there down. Yeah. So in that case, we can say don't cross this pedestrian crossing in here. Pick your lane, pick your lane, but don't cross the pedestrian crossing. Uh, I leave this one intact in case they want to walk over here. Although I could pick the, you um, see this one, just cross this road and go, let me see where does this finish up. Actually, I'm going to pull this straight forward to all the way to the, uh, yeah, to the area here. And let's make it go down here. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that's not a bad idea. Did I forgot something? No, I didn't. Yes, uh, about this junction. Okay, traffic manager. Okay, let's select the uh, junction restrictions. We say like, you may drive on. You also, but you cannot. You can pick whatever lane you want. You too, coming from this side. And also you can pick your lane. Right. Then we click on lane arrows, and we click on the control button, and we click on it. And we have like designated turning lanes for each one of them. Then we go to the priority signs and we say like, you have to give way and you have priority. That works best. What an insidious amount of traffic is going through this city. It is crazy how, you know, I don't even have, I have despawning off. Currently disabled, the hard mode. <laughs> Still the traffic is doing pretty nice at 86% yes it's still doing well okay let's uh, let's turn this thing not yet on so this is sort of yeah ready I suppose I mean we have the parking lots they can go there fine enough for me 
now we need to put in the uh, remaining stuff uh, for this campus now let's also take the roads and that was the red one which was this one yeah now we need to create some space okay Let's take this to roughly there and then from here to there. Is that not too close? A little bit, but it's okay. Okay, we'll fix that in a minute. From here we go to there. You know, this is the, um, yeah, the train station. So from here they will yeah, they also have to be able to walk to the dormitories, of course. Yes, they step out here and then let's use the pathway, this one, to just walk over here, like that, to there, and then to there. Oh man, this is awesome. <laughs> this is actually awesome. Loving it. Uh, dormitories. Uh, let me see. School. School. Liberal arts. Yeah. So we need the dormitory, which is this one. Now, this building is pretty elongated. So I have another idea about that. School. We take this path. I saw that the school was. The, 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 we're going to put this in the middle yep like that this is not good so we're going to move this a little upwards like that and the nice thing is now we can put more dorms into here like one over there and one let me see yep and one over there one over there which which is just sticking inside of the fence which is nice if I turn anarchy off then it's like okay yeah look at that then it's proper how many students can fit in here 300 400 only 28 available oh, okay this is uh, pretty nice and what is also what also would be nice would be like to have a pathway coming from Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm on a roll, guys. I'm really on a roll today. Let's turn off the anarchy and say like... Seven meters. Uh, just turn the toggle or road collision off and we go all the way across here. Is this straight or not? What is straight? This is straight. And then down, I cannot see anything here because of all these trees, but it is connected. And let's remove a few trees so it becomes visible. Yeah, it is connected. Let's make it a little bit closer. Just like, well, I prefer this with a little bend. Yeah, just like that. Already somebody is going over it. And <laughs> look at this parking lot. <laughs> that is really looking ridiculous. I will just remove it because I refuse to put like anybody who wants to live there. It's crazy. It's out of their mind. Nobody will be living here. Also here. Let's remove these. Okay, they can just go, they will remove, and there is a pillar in the middle of the road, which we also cannot have. We will move it slightly to there, and we just lower it a bit, sorry, squeaking chair. Yeah, that will do nicely. And is this in the middle? Not entirely, just a little bit to the, yeah, perfect. Thank you. Now, what did I say? Go away. Uh, yeah, 
nice so people can also walk from there to there hmm hmm yeah yeah liking it liking it liking it also from here a little bit like that yeah not bad although there's a little arch in here we can do something about that make it a little bit steep just normal plain straight like that perfect great now what we have to do more is like we have to place these uh, other buildings as well so because we have a whole bunch of them and we will take them one by one so let's start with the liberal arts study hall now this is a pretty big building and we are going to place it not there i think can we put it here yep we can and then we select the liberal arts groundskeeping which is a small building which will will, will perfectly fit around here then the drama club for all the drama that it will be coming to this you know this art club i mean at the art a lot of drama <laughs> okay let's go to the outdoor study it's a big building oh it does not fit there pity oh but we can put it here so this is a nice spot at the end then we take the liberal arts gymnasium where which we can put like does it fit here? It will fit. Yeah, with a little. F yeah, you don't even see it touching. No, it's fine. It's just fine. So, okay, we go on. And this building is the cafeteria. Is this the right building? Ooh, it's a big one, you know? It's for the hungry students, so we need that actually close by. Now, there is some space here. Mm, how can I make use of that? Um, okay, let's make uh, another path from a path from here. No, nope, wait, 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 wait. From here to there. And can we also go from here to there? Yeah, nice, 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 nice. And maybe also from here to there mm, yeah sort of parallel with that fence but let's pull this down because I want to t really take it parallel with that fence oh that looks wonderful wonderful where were we the cafeteria it's this building yeah, cafeteria 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 so we can place that over here and you know what we place two of them then the liberal arts fountain here we go again with those you know bestie things fountains nicely here yeah a library okay library uh, what about across this area over here I think it's okay you know I'm thinking you know about about the size because this you know we are do we do not take you know all the space that we have available so I'm putting this here and fountain library because you know I think we do not have that much left the art club I will just put it here This, yeah, this is the art club yes then we take the liberal arts commencement office yes the place where people are getting uh, where they get celebrated it would be fitting to put it over here but yeah but indeed I like that not to be on that road directly but actually to take this road and say like go to there like that and put this building here right next to it and can we put like a parking spot in between 
100% we can because we take a parking spot. It's this one. Here you go. And at the same time we say like no parking over here. Park on the parking spot. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Where were we? School. This is the uh, commencement of it. Okay. Next one. Another statue. These guys are really full of themselves, but okay. Let's put that over there. Then we have like an auditorium. We put that, let's see, over there. So we can also put like a parking lot in between. Uh, laboratories. It's a pretty big building, but it's okay. We put it also over here with six spots in between. And oh, we do still have some buildings left. Four pieces. Liberal Arts Bookstore. Okay, the guys are sitting here, so can they have it pretty close or not? Let me see. Yeah, they can have it here. Just like that. But what I'm going to do is like extending that uh, path. This path to there. And from here we will go to there. And from here we will go to there. Okay. Uh, where were we? Where were we? Where were we? This was the last one. It was the liberal, the bookstore. Okay, the bookstore. Uh, meet, no, wait a second. This is the bookstore. This is the liberal arts media lab. Can we put it? Oh, we can squeeze it nicely into here. I love it. This is the dance club. Wait a second, select it. You can just put it right here with parking space left of it. Yeah. Uh, another statue. And that's the last one, I suppose. We can put that one over there. And we are completed. Yay! It's not that bad. It did not took that much space, actually. So now let's connect uh, things a little bit up and we are going to play some uh, strategically placed uh, parking lots. For example, uh, one over here, one over there, one over there, one over there, one over there. And let me see, where's that train station? Oh, it's over there. So let's put like, parking lot yeah here and there and also one over there yeah so actually this road did not even need to be uh, you know put on the ground but what I can do is reduce the noise I don't know if uh, the college would you know have any problems with it but you know I can always take the noise barrier road like this yeah like that and also do the same for the two laner yeah yeah, from here it's not necessary anymore. And with the one laner, we can only achieve that by saying, uh, going up, like here, here, and here. Here, 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 and here, and here. Thank you for the trees. Um, wait a second, we forgot a little piece of two laner, which is this. No, oh, no, nope, the wrong one. This. Yeah, I think that will do nicely. Let's check out the lane connectors. Are they still in place? Nope, they are not. You go there, you go there. Yeah, like that. I don't think anything has changed over here. So this is still nice. Yeah, I think that's okay. Not bad. So let's see if we can draw a few roads, uh, in, uh, pathways in here. Uh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> pathways. 
Now let's see, what can we connect? For example, this path is very important to the facility sports. Uh, let's go to here and then to the other side and then we go down from here to... It's not entirely straight. I can already see that. So let's do this from the other side then. From here and then to there. Now we go up. Six to there to there. Ah, uh, okay, it's because another type of uh, pathway. Okay, but it's fine. And from here we go also down to. Ah, uh, thank you. Here to there. So they can also walk on this side of the road. And I see already a lot of parked cars over here. So I want to give them some options to park their cars. I don't know why these guys are parking their cars oh, already over here, but uh, I don't want too much parking around. So park, no park, no park. Most of these uh, red roads are parkable park park but uh, yeah I don't want the uh, cars to be parked there so, I mean these buildings have uh, spots to park so nothing nothing going on uh, also this road you know we can make an asymmetrical road using the 2x1 uh, laner which is this one yeah like that We take this option, we take the uh, lane arrows and we say control, like that, control, like that, and actually, oh no, wait a second, this is also one for turning left, ah, okay, so we need actually, ah, Interesting. So what we need here is actually, uh, what is this road? This road. Yeah, like that. Like that. And like that. To that roundabout, yeah. So now we have like three separate lanes going each way. And actually, yeah, here also. <laughs> yeah. But mm, also here? Well... Um, one for right, one for going on. You know, I'm thinking more like normal road, I think, su uh, suffices. Just like something like this. Yeah, I think that will do better. And let's see, let's give these guys some priorities. Uh, junction restrictions, now cut the crap out with this option. Okay, pick your lane, you go there, you can pick your lane. And give way, give way, nope, don't stop, yeah, that's fine. Pick your lane. I mean, not that there are many lanes to choose from, but anyway, let's do it anyway. You ca can carry on, you and you as well. And here we go. Select this button. Designated turning lanes. Nice. Um, this one I don't want to go to the left, so only to the right. If they want to turn, then. You know, they can just, you know what, maybe I can build, just build a roundabout in here. Just a two lane roundabout, a small one. Just like this. Ah, oh, it's such a lovely looking roundabout, I love it. <laughs> oh, it's just so cute, 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 roundabout. Okay, turning lanes, turning lanes, designated turning lanes, okay. Pick your lane, pick your lane. Pick your lane. It's just on a campus, but okay. At least they can just turn around if they want to. 
Well, that's, the ni that's the nicest thing about roundabouts. Uh, peeps can just go where they want. Uh, yeah, for the rest it seems uh, pretty okay to me. Uh, let me see. Maybe a path from here to the other side. From here to there. Yeah, and then... Now let me see if we go from here to... Oh, that does not work. Let's go up five meters. Three down. You go there. 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 You go there, you go there, you go there. It's not bad. So let's remove the options for these guys to use the pedestrian crossings. Would save a lot of uh, yeah, unnecessary crossings. Okay, so the varsity sports, let's check them out. We turn them whoa 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 we check we turn them on now now let's see what can we give them this is a lot of money by the way let's turn this off and also we can give darn it my oh it's... we can also give this uh, university a grant Let's see, what can we do? Policies, uh, healthcare, free lunch, visiting scholars, fan club support, advertisement campaign, the whole schmuck, except for this one, for the tuition fees. And we start with the kinematography. Kinema cinema, 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 oh my gosh, my English. <laughs> cinema, 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 I can't say the word geography, cinematogra, whatever. Give it the grant, they will be happy. Here we go. Varsity sports, uh, what are these? What it's saying? Cheerleading budget. Okay, so let's put it like half, and this is like coaching stuff, but also to half, which is nice. So, yeah, now every town has like its own. Um, yeah, varsity sport, which is nice. Every uh, campus, I mean. And uh, yeah, so this the only thing uh, that this campus needs is uh, basically more trees, I suppose. A little bit more dressing, a little bit more stones, and maybe even, you know, a nice, nice body of water around here. Can we fit that in this episode? I think so. I think so. We are going to do that. So let's put this low. So how low does that go already? Uh, okay, now let's take this option. Uh, let's take this depth. Okay. And put it right across the buildings like that. Yeah, also in between here a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I think that will do nicely. Yeah, because already I, you know, I removed a little bit of, the, of that stuff over here. So, would it not be nice to connect this with that? Ah, huh. yeah. So let's move, you know, make a little bit of you know unnatural uh, unman unmanmade you know structure just a little bit wild is everything and all that kind of stuff um let's pause the game for a moment because we need to remove a uh, piece of highway over here and over here because i need to make a hole 
in the ground. <laughs> yeah, like that. Just a simple hole in the ground. Thank you. Now let's put that road back. Where is it? This one. Is it a curved one? A little bit. Wait a second, we put it in bridge mode. No, 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 that is too short. Uh, this option. No, wrong road. That's first of all, and wrong button. This one, this one. Here we go. It's, yeah, it's become, you know, my thing, you know, to touch these buttons like 50 million times. Okay, now that water will flow from there to there. Now let's remove also the trees because we don't want any trees on the bottom of the brush string tire. Oops, and we first have to select a tree. So trees, 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 no trees there. No trees there. Yep, that's, uh, this is okay. Yeah, that will fill up eventually to this area. I mean, I don't need uh, an extra water source for that, but uh, it adds a little bit of charm to this uh, to this area because we can, for example, put now all kinds of um, trees. What kind of trees? What would we like around here? Let me see. What kind of tree is this? Oh, wait a second. This. So I just put a random amount of trees around this edge. Not too much, like that. Then we take a palm tree. No, it's too short. And we need something bigger. This one? This one? Yeah, I like that. Not too many of those because those are pretty big. So only a few of them. Otherwise, it will become too clumpy. Yeah, so what do we have? Oh, these red ones are nice. They stick out so so wonderful in this area. Or in any area. Just that little, you know, that just that little tad, tad of red in between. It makes it all worthwhile looking at it. And yeah, I can fill up this entire episode by, you know, dressing this whole uh, area up. But uh, yeah, that's more like for a next episode, I suppose. Or, well, maybe I do it off screen and we'll show you it later. I don't know. But uh, so far, this is uh, really looking great. Yeah. And before I'm leaving, maybe we can take the the rose red this one and take the line prop tool and say like you know make a nice line over there just a little bit of decoration and here we go no ah, just there that will do fine okay so the water is seeping in which is nice uh, the campus area is uh, building wise ready. The only thing that it requires now is more uh, yeah, trees and stuff. Oh, look at this blue, blue, blue building. You know, it looks nice in front. Uh, wait a second. I think, yeah, this is better. Otherwise, the logo will be in front of it. Look at this. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, guys, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you soon back in uh, part 67. And uh, then we will, well, we will see what we will do then. Uh, I think I will, I don't know, maybe I will devote the episode for making this uh, a bit more, yeah, nice with uh, trees and rocks and I don't know, uh, whatever. And then I have to think about uh, something else that I still can place into this city. Because I think that sooner or later I will hit the city limits. But we have to watch that. Okay guys, thank you for watching and I see you next time. See you, bye bye.